Good morning and welcome to Tallinn. We are in Estonia. Um, we've come to the city of Tallinn. It's known as like one of the medieval cities. It's absolutely beautiful. So come along while we explore. I'm going to give you a quick room tour. It's a small single room so there's not a lot to show you. Um, I am staying at the Tallinn Spa and Conference Hotel. There is um, an amazing spa down in the reception which I'll show you. Yeah, there's an amazing spa down in the reception, which I'll show you. But this is the room, so you come in the door. They've got the most insane carpets. Um, very large mirror. Hello. Uh, we come over here. We've got a fridge, a little chair, it's literally a single bed. And then you come in here, shower, another big mirror. And a toilet. So yeah, um, we're gonna go head out now. I found a place called Five Senses, which is a brunch place. So we're gonna go there now. We're gonna have some brunch, get a coffee because I am dying for a coffee. Um, and then we'll get exploring. When I sit for brunch, I'm gonna sort of create like a plan of what I want to do today and get done. Tomorrow we're doing something very exciting but it's going to be a separate vlog so this vlog is just going to be telling and tomorrow we're going to a different country. So come along with me. Let's go and get some brunch. It's a 14 minute walk so I'll catch up with you when we get there. Let's go. Okay so the first brunch spot was a vlog because it wasn't even open. So we ended up in Lulu's which was also um, recommended to me and we've got a slow cooked barbecue beef bagel. entry um, and it is definitely worth a look because it is so beautiful so so beautiful I'll show you around wow I'm sorry, I, let me move my back. I'm sorry, I can't really talk to you in there because we were in a church. Um, so that was, sorry, not a church, we were in a cathedral. Well, that was St. Mary's Cathedral in Tallinn. Um, I've now come over here because I have a feeling over there is a panoramic view to the city. Um, I always light candles when I go into a church, a cathedral, any place of worship, just to, I always like two to resemble both sets of my grandparents. Um, so I did that, had a bit of a moment thinking about them, and now I'm heading to see the panoramic views of the city. So let's go see what it has to offer. I am sat with panoramic views of the city behind me, doing what she loves, exploring again, somewhere new. Um, Tallinn so far, very medieval, very... I feel like I've slightly gone back in time. I absolutely love it here so much. Um, I'm going to go back soon and jig it out. I've just come to like a really cute little tavern place to try the local beer. So. Delicious. I love 
like trying beers from different places. Well, I asked for a local one and this is the one she gave me, so I'm hoping it is actually a local one. Otherwise, I look like an idiot on the internet, but it wouldn't be the first time. Why do I look like I've got like handlebars? Look at that. I don't know my bangs are growing out. So far, Talon's a hit. I've had such like a slow paced day as well, which is really, really nice because normally I'm like itinerary fast paced and I just thought, you know, chill. <laughs> this city is truly beautiful. I mean, like, I don't know if you can hear the birds, but it's so peaceful. There's not people swarmed everywhere. There is beauty, honestly. It is incredible. It's literally like you've gone back in time to like a medieval place. Like, what's this say? The Gate Tower of the Short Leg, the, histori the historical connection between the most famous ghost stories. Okay, ghosts on the other hand are not <laughs> Charlotte's thing. Charlotte is horrifically terrified <laughs> of ghosts. And when I show you the statue that we're about to go near, absolutely not. Absolutely not. This is truly one of the most beautiful cities in Europe that I've ever been to. It's, I, I can't even describe it into words, I don't know how to put it. Like, it's just beautiful and it's so peaceful. It is so peaceful, like, there is barely anybody around. It's insane. What have you said? And this is what I mean about the architecture and the culture. Like, I've turned around another corner and the beautiful building. Like, it's so insane. I love it here. It's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. The people are lovely. And I feel very safe. I feel very safe as a solo female traveller. So I know I said I was coming to the old town on the last day, but I think I've accidentally stumbled across it. So while we're here, we're just gonna take a look around and see what we can do. Again, it is absolutely stunning. We're currently sat in an egg chair in the middle of the old town. Just chill actually. I love this city. Hello everybody and welcome back to Talon, so I've just come back from um, Helsinki, such an amazing day of Evelina, but one of the things she wanted me to try was Hesburgo. It is a Finnish fast food chain and she said I needed to try it, so I found out they had one in Tallinn, so I went on my way back to the hotel, so I thought we'd try it together. Now, she said that the chicken wrap was the best, so we've got a chicken wrap here, and she also said about the mayonnaises. I know you think mayonnaise. So in the wrap, I've got paprika mayonnaise. And then I've got some fries. And to try with my fries, I've got cucumber mayonnaise and curry mayonnaise. And she said they were amazing too. And then I've also got some onion rings, which look a little bit anemic. So let's try an onion ring first. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Usually there's cream cheese in the wrap, however, I don't like cheese, so I've got the cheese taken out. Mm. 
Mm -hmm. Oh, it's like, sorry. Let me try and pull out a piece of chicken. Like, thin strips of, mm. thin strips of seasoned chicken. That is amazing. And that paprika mayo. Mmm. Ten ten. So let's crack open these other mayos. And we'll try it on the chips. Sorry. Right, so I've got the curry mayonnaise. Wow, that is amazing, that is so good. Oh my God, that is so good. Look, it's like, that's so, so good. Wow, mmm, delicious. Now, cucumber mayonnaise. I asked Evelina if it tastes like tzatziki. That's like a cucumbery dip, isn't it? She said no, so I'm intrigued. Get a chip. We've got a big old dip of that one. It just tastes like normal mayonnaise, but like fresh. Do you know what I mean? It's a little bit like a very, very mild salad cream. That's what it tastes like. But that curry mayonnaise, when I want a chicken dinner, 10 out of 10. Should we try the cucumber mayo with them on the um, on your ring? I like how fresh that is to be fair. Now the curry one on the onion ring. Oh. Mmm. 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 Right. I'm going to sit and enjoy this and watch a bit of Marky Ferris. And then I will see you in the morning. I think tomorrow we're going to do an art gallery and the spa. And then we fly home for a night. Love you. Good morning, it's the final day and we are getting ready to go to the spa. Literally go down like this in your robe and slippers. Um, and then you just take your towel with you. I'm gonna leave my phone up here on charge because um, I managed to keep the door. Whereas we're gonna have a no phone. Actually, maybe I can just dropping everything dropping literally everything um but yeah i'm gonna try and film i'm gonna try and take some stuff but obviously if there's people in there i can't film so bear with me i am really trying for the content these slippers are very noisy you can hear them um also there is an outdoor pool you can see it just down there it's big it goes like under this bit um it is huge. This hotel is beautiful. I've just had breakfast. I didn't take you with me because I was in a rush because I almost missed it. Because um, I think I went down at like 10 to 9. So I had natural yogurt with granola and peaches and lingonberries um, and some like pumpkin seeds and sunflower seeds. It was absolutely delicious. So I just had that. So let's go to the spa and then we need to come up and shower and check out at 12. So yeah, spa day baby. 
we are in the spa. I'm gonna try and show you as much as I can, but there is people in there, so let's go. These are the toilets. <laughs> There's a Finnish sauna in there. Oh God. There's a Finnish sauna there. You've got, these are the normal showers, hang on. Film as much as I can. Without getting people in. And then, around here you've got massage showers. And then there's more saunas around there. And then here, you've got the main pool area which is, go, also goes outside to where you can see in my balcony. Balcony in my window. So like this goes all the way through and outside. And then you come around here and you've got the big pool, you've got all the jets. You've got a jacuzzi there, but there's people in there, so I'm gonna film it. And then you've got like more jets around there. And then I've just been sat in this side of the jacuzzi and there's more jets over there and then there's also like a swim up bar so you can use a different colour wristband I'm not going to be here long enough to warrant getting a drink but um, you can use your different colour wristbands why do I look so red? to basically get drinks at the bar it's like a swim up bar where you do cocktails and beers and everything like that so it's actually amazing here like it's beautiful it's so nice this was definitely worth the um, worth the stay and worth the money. I'm going to leave a link to the, there's a baby pool there, I'm not going to go there. I'm going to leave a link to the hotel that I booked um, in the description box below. So please check it out because I actually got a really good deal. So um, yeah, it was really, really good. So yeah, I'm going to go and enjoy the spa now. I'm going to peek back in my locker and you're going to manage to vlog, come on now. I'll catch up with you when I'm back in the room, showered and we're going to explore. Okay so, okay, so my ticket to come up to the tower was one euro, which I don't think is that bad. There's lots of, there's an exhibition, you can see panoramic views of the city. Um, yeah, quite a bit. It's a lot about their history. Um, let's have a little look if we sort of step back in time, which is really, really nice. If you're into history and culture, um, then yeah, definitely come and check it out. I've got like a cherry cake, it's a bit like a... The cross between a baked cheesecake and a crumble and also a cappuccino. While looking out, onto that. So. Back to Town Hall Square. I'm sat in a restaurant called Bella Ciao. When you're ready, let's now. I'm ready. Yeah. Yeah, this girl is ready. Hello. Hello. Are you ready? Yeah, can what I have like? um, spaghetti bolognese, please? Okay. With no cheese. Okay, no cheese. No Would cheese. you like to drink something? Do you have a pearl spritz? Yes. Can I have a pearl spritz? Okay. Thank you. The best one in the world, Polish girl. <laughs> the best one. The best one in the world. So, my food is here. I have got a hollandaise. And I've also got a pearl spritz. Cheers. I'm going to eat with you for a minute. Let's taste test. I was in a pasta mood, you know. Mm. 
Delicious. I'm gonna enjoy this. Enjoy my last few hours in the stone. I've just ordered another half hour because I mean I've got a few hours and I've done everything I wanted to see so now it's time for me to chill for a while. Um, I've got about two and a half to three hours before I need to get in the airport so um, yeah not long now but this is the square. It's absolutely stunning. We're gonna have a walk around and then we might have a little, little basket and rub situation. Who knows? Really nice day. Yeah.